Hi, my name is Anna White. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the easiest way to build your own closet organizers using a French cleat system, which makes it easy to hang. Click the link in the description to download the free project plans that come with this video. The plans include five different components that you can use to create a custom closet. For my closet, I built a five shelf tower and a one shelf hanging unit. All the components follow the same basic build steps. You can use one by 12s or three quarter inch plywood like I'm doing here. And all you do is cross cut your pieces and then drill three pocket holes on each end of all of the shelf boards and then attach the shelf boards to the sides. A one by six is used for the back support and the French cleat. Now I'm gonna do the French cleat here in the top. And what I did is I basically cut a second one by six here, and I'm gonna rip this at a 45 degree angle. It's better to use a table saw if you have a table saw. If you don't have a table saw, I'm gonna show you how to do it with a circular saw. This is the one by six that I just ripped. You can see the two pieces. And um, so how this is gonna work is one of the pieces, I'll nail to the top. And then the other piece, this piece, I'll screw this to the studs in the wall and then we can just go ahead and hang the closet on it when we're ready. Now, what you, you don't wanna do short pieces like this. What you really wanna do is figure out the entire length of your closet, cut one one by six that entire length, rip it, save one of the pieces for the cleat that goes on the wall and then use the remaining piece to make these up. A French cleat will be used for hanging so I stapled it on with glue. You can also use one and five eighths inch trim screws. After that, I painted everything with a brush and roll method. Now it's time to install it in the closet. So I mark the studs in the wall at about the location I want to hang the French cleat. And then I put one screw into a stud. I'm using three inch long self-tapping star bit screws. Then I just leveled up the French cleat and finished screwing off the studs in the wall and hung my components on the French cleat. So once you're happy with your closet configuration and everything's hung, I do recommend adding a few screws in between the two pieces and into studs in the wall just as a safety precaution. I've installed closets before, but let me tell you, using the French cleat made this closet install super easy and it gives me options in the future to change things up if I need to.